For those of you who are already pretty interested in pursuing medicine um, in high school, looking back, I definitely have a few recommendations for you. Um, I would recommend trying to find hospital volunteering opportunities uh, just to get yourself familiar, familiarized uh, with the medical environment. Uh, this has two main benefits. It'll provide you with an early picture of where you might see yourself working in a future medical career. And um, it'll provide you um, with um, just increased volunteering experiences, which is something that medical schools really, really like to see. Um, I'd also recommend just finding a cause or opportunity that you're truly passionate about and devoting a couple hours a week to volunteering for that cause. Uh, this will not only add to your sense of social responsibility and personal impact, but also really show to colleges that you are community oriented and have passions for service that will extend uh, to your future career path. And it's really important for medicine. Um, next, I would also recommend just trying out all sorts of clubs that pertain to your interests and hobbies. Uh, this will definitely add to the enjoyment of your high school experience and also allow you to meet people with similar interests. It will also allow you to um, explore your interests more with your peers and um, it doesn't hurt to show colleges that you're just not, you're not just another student who only focuses on schoolwork and gets good grades, um, kind of like a robot. Uh, try to find a shadowing opportunity with a doctor nearby, um, maybe a couple hours a week or so. You can start out by asking, you know, some, someone like your uh, primary care physician or even someone, you know, who's a doctor. However, uh, just keep in mind that there are often uh, restrictions in place that might prevent some physicians from accepting shadowing. Um, so don't be too discouraged if you get a couple of rejections. And sometimes hospitals may have programs in place where you volunteer with them for something like 200 hours or so. Um, and then you get to shadow a physician for a couple of days, which is also a pretty valuable experience. Um, it's also super beneficial for you to find a mentor at some point. This can be either in high school or college. I personally didn't really find a solid mentor until I began my current job at Kaiser Permanente. Uh, but if you're able to find one earlier on, that would be great. Uh, finding someone who has already walked this path to give you advice and insight is extremely beneficial for some broadened perspective. And it's also a really great way to learn about things that you might not know about or consider otherwise. I'd also recommend finding some sort of research opportunity at a university or hospital nearby if that's available. Uh, this is obviously by no means necessary. It's just a huge plus if you're able to. And diving into research early on can help you uh, discover and learn a lot of things that you might not have considered before. It's also looked upon very favor favorably by uh, colleges and medical schools. And lastly, if you become pretty certain that you'd like to become a doctor by junior or senior year of high school, you would have the option to apply to BSMD programs, which are basically a fast track way of becoming a doctor. So if you do get into one of these programs, you won't have to worry about applying to medical school after receiving your undergraduate degree. So you'll actually be put in an accelerated program where you'll be able to obtain your MD or medical degree in just seven years. And this basically just saves you a whole year of school. Um, however, keep in mind that these programs are extremely competitive. So while it's worth a try to apply to these, um, don't be discouraged if you don't get in. Uh, if you do decide to apply to these programs, you probably already have a pretty big head start, at least a very big head start on me, uh, on beginning on all the activities uh, needed for your medical explorations. And this will only make you that much better of a candidate when you apply to medical school in the future, like after you get your degree.